so that's what that looks like. All right, got the seat belt mount under there. You can see that, All right? That platform there. Now that's identical to the other side where he's welding. So you'd be able to take the seat and switch them if you want. Now we gotta make a tab up here. And then we'll put those tabs down there. All right, so we got the, the seat mounts made up. Got the floor seat belts made up on both sides. Now we're gonna do the back of the seat tab. Oh, he's getting in there. He's trying to situate himself so he can get in there. I want to make the tabs from behind the seat. So now what we'll do is we'll mark the seat, put holes in the seat, put holes in the back of the seat. And then we'll put that seat on that side and put them both in the same spot. Steering column's coming out nice. <coughs> Other tab is done for the seats. It'll go on either side. We gotta finish making some holes in it. And then once he's done with this on this side, then he'll start putting the door bars on that side, and I'll keep working on the brake pedal. Alrighty. Alright, so this is all in. Nice and strong. Connected it on the bottom. Kind of hard to see. And Made the supports there. So that's all in. That's all in. That's in the right spot. So we're just gonna finish making up the brake pedal, the seat, all that. Everything's in. So brake pedal and gas pedal. And then we'll put the door bars in. Alright, so we're gonna start making all the little stuff now. Got this rubber seal made for that. Put the hole in there for the shifter. So that sits on there like that. Be able to seal that off. I'm working on the pedal right now. Got this. I got to weld this up. And then put the actual pedal on there. I'm going to do that. Get that mounted in there. And then we're going to make these two pieces here. Josh already made them up. I'm going to weld them in. And finish welding the rest of that side of that floor real quick. The nose piece or the front half, the front fiberglass should be coming hopefully tomorrow, I think. And then we'll be able to start actually mounting that and then make all the fasteners for the front. And we'll start, once we get that, once we know that it all fits, then we'll take everything apart and do all the painting and priming and whatnot. All right, so we got this pedal. I got it tacked in place. It's way out past where it was before, so you can reach it out of the way of everything it don't hit anything I got plenty of plenty of room all right so it's all just tacked right now I gotta take it out I'll weld the whole thing up so we tweaked it moved it twisted it cut it shaped it but it looks good and it's gonna work good all right let me get it out and weld it all up all right so we got that all nice and done thing looks great I'm gonna paint it up and put it in. All right, so now I, got, I gotta fix this spot here and then fill in these little holes that they they uh, riveted, right? And then we'll put the panel on there and weld it on. Same thing with the bottom one. All right, well, so we got all this ground down, filled all the little holes, fixed this little corner that was missing a piece. Got all that fixed, now I'm just gonna go in there and tack the pieces in. All right, so I'm gonna go get a piece cut for this have it bent the way I need it so we're gonna put the mounted gauges in there so first thing I'm gonna do is just go get this piece cut up so it's nice and clean all right so we got this I gotta make this fit in here like this we're getting this to go in here 
And then we're going to put gauges in here and put the tack here like this. In the middle. These we welded in. I think we're going to... Because this was welded in from the inside. So it looks clean. When it's going to be painted, it'll be clean. It'll have a nice edge on it. This, I guess it'll look all right when it's all black. But I'm thinking, all right, we'll just put some Bondo around the edges like that. Round it all off so it looks smooth. So it'll be smooth. And then, uh, where's the glove box? See what the glove box looks like over there. Oh, well, that we already got painted. Got the brake pedals up there. That's all painted. That's done. It's all painted up. The Ford brake pedal. I'm trying to get this dash done, and then we're gonna we're gonna paint this. You guys, and I, oh, I gotta make this little cover here for this thing, and then we could paint that. How's that fit? No. That's fine. That goes. This goes just like that. Oh, there's no, there's no trim. On it. Well, the can give you trim for it. I don't know if there's trim. Oh, I didn't see that. All right, this. Oh, we're gonna, uh, gonna mount this back in there and then cut this little hump out of it. Unless there was some in the box. Got to make a cover for this. The no, there was nothing else. There. Huh? The ashtray just slot. Yeah, the ashtray just pops in, I think. Ashtray should oh, Yeah, to... he gave you the cover and everything, yep. It's probably got two screws that hold that in. Let me see that thing. So now we need to, we need the door. There's a cover that probably goes over that. Yeah. This obviously goes to the top. This goes like this. There's two little screws that go in there. Everything will be covered Everything will be nice and black. I'll be nice. This goes like that. And then the hinge goes in here. This is supposed yeah. to be your stock. But now we're missing... Uh, we're like missing... Uh, he's got this. But we're missing whatever this is. Whatever these holes are. That sucks. There's probably two pieces of trim. Yeah. If not... Uh, we'll make some. Dang. Gonna fill them, but if we fill them, we're gonna start warping this thing. No, no. I'll tell them to get this the trim. This is the SS emblem. Huh? Glove what box. Is this is the glove box SS emblem. Yeah, well, that, after we paint it, we'll put that on. Is, or has it got pins? Is it pins or a sticker? Yeah, it's got pins. Bro. All right, we'll worry about that later. What about the, the lock? Did he get the lock? Uh, See if the lock is in there. Uh, okay, so we're gonna bondle this up so that looks that And then we good. gotta put that piece in the back there. We still gotta make this fit. And that should be it. Give me a square or something. Just I need to make a straight line so we can cut it. So we need to cut that, then cut that, fit it in there, and then we'll figure out where the little hump gets cut. Here, cut that, Josh. While I'm in there.
gonna go like that. I'm gonna put a little little tab on this. Put a little tab on the bottom so that that stays like that. And then we'll go get his gauges, and it's gonna probably be like one, two, or one, two, and wherever the tack goes. So we'll probably mount the tack to wherever it goes first, however high it goes first, and then make the gauges fit like that. Going uh, in all his stuff, there's a tack on the floor, right? And then there's a box with four brand new gauges. Go get them. Right, so Josh is finishing that up. Let me get that. Getting closer. And then this is what the dash is going to look like, basically. So gauge, 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 tack, shift light in the middle, directional, directional. A little lights, but a directionals. And that's it. All right. So ashtrays in there. Um, he's going to get one of these. We're going to use one of these for uh, headlights. One of them is going to be a pull for his fire system when he gets that. All the other switches are going up on the top. All right. Now we got that patched. That hole is shut. And that's going to go like that. That gets a little bead of silicone around the edge. So now we know that's where that goes. Um, I'm not going to take this off till we figure out what we're doing with the front clip. So I know there's going to be stuff hanging off of this. We got to figure what that goes with that. So now I got to take this panel off, make the holes on the bottom, make all these holes so that the gauges all fit. And then what we'll do is we'll prime paint that, and then we'll be able to mount all the gauges and stuff. I got to make a little tab to mount this tack on there. And that should be good. So basically, it's going to look like. Let's see if I can do this. So, steering wheel goes on. Uh, yeah. Let me put the steering wheel on. I should put the steering wheel on. When you're sitting in here. That's basically what I'm looking at, just like that. So, so if I'm sitting in here, I'm looking at that, just like that. It's actually really pretty good. All right. Then we push the center of the floor up. Yep. So you got that pretty much. Yeah. Now let's go. I'm gonna push the floor up when you get a minute. Uh, yep. Another thing I'm doing right now is I'm I'm gonna cut this. This is the original that he was using. Not original to the car, but this is the one that he came with. Uh, gas pedal setup. So I'm going to cut the end of this off and extend it and put it at the right angle because now that's actually two inches further back, right? So that being further back is where we needed it further back anyway so he could reach everything. So I'm going to make this just a little bit longer even and then we'll make it set up the way it's supposed to be set up. 